Hey guys, my name is Logan, and welcome back to Plants vs. Zombies. So, we're back where we left off. We were reading about the plants, so... Let's finish. Let's finish the descriptions of them. People wonder how I feel about getting constantly chewed on by zombies, says Walnut. What they don't realize is that my, with my limited senses, all I can feel is... A kind of tingling like a relaxing back rub. Some folks say Potato Mine is lazy, that he leaves everything to the last minute. Potato Mine says nothing. He's too busy thinking about his investment strategy. Okay, Snow Pea. Folks of, t folks of ten tell Snow Pea how cool he is or exhort hi him to chill out. They tell him to stay frosty. Snow Pea just rolls his eyes. He's heard them all. Okay, Chomper. Chomper almost got a gig doing stunts in Hollywood, but it fell through when his agent demanded too much on the front end. Chomper's not only resentful, though. He says it's just part of the business. Repeater. Repeater is fierce. He's, fr he's from the streets. He doesn't take attitude from anybody, plant or zombie, and he shoots peas to keep people at a distance. Secretly, though, Repeater yearns for love. Okay. I only recently became aware of this existence of zombies, says Puffshroom. Like many fungi, I just assumed they were fairy tales or movie monsters. This whole experience has been a huge eye-opener for me. Okay, Sunshroom. Sunshroom hates sun. He hates it so much that when it builds up in his system, he spits it out as fast as he can. He just won't abide it to, to sun in his grass. Okay, Funshroom. I was in a dead-end job producing yeast spores for bakery, for a bakery, says Funshroom. Then Puffshroom... Bless I'm told me about this great opportunity blasting zombies. Now I'm really feel now I really feel like I'm making a difference. And Gravebuster. Despite Gravebuster's fearsome appearance, he might he wants everyone to know that he loves kittens and spends his off hours volunteering at a local zombie rehabilitation center. It's just the right thing to do, he says. So, we finished with the almanac, finished reading the, oh, stop it, we finished reading the almanac, so let's get into it. Every play, ever play a game called Whack-A-Zombie? It's just like hunting scorbos. You know those furry little rodents that dig holes in your lawn? Yeah, just like that, but instead of scorbos, it's zombies. And instead of a shovel, it's a mallet. And instead of me, it's you. Oh. Okay. This is level two of five, so we're halfway through. So halfway through the um, night levels. Okay. Okay, get him, get him, get him. If I remember in this game, they drop sun, and you can get like a grave buster, I think. Where are these zombies? Okay. Yeah, they do drop sun, so get rid of that. So I'm just gonna be getting grave busters. There's too many zombies. Get that. Okay. Mm. 
Need to get these zombies. He's, there's too many of them. Need to get the grave buster. Okay. Need to get another grave buster. There's too many freaking zombies. Wait, back to game. Back to game. Okay, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. No, get Grave Buster. Okay. Get that Grave Buster. I can just put a few Grave Busters down. I got a hypno shroom. Hypno shroom makes a zombie fight for you. So we're gonna go to the next level because that one was pretty short. And we're gonna just see how long this level is. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna be able to do it, but we'll just. I'm gonna sacrifice the cherry bomb. Get a walnut. Hmm. Play. Oh, I forgot about the graves. That level was getting kind of difficult. Yeah, but I want to see how long this level is. If it's like two flags or one flag. If it's like a two stage thing. Oh, it's just one. Okay, so after this level, after this level, I'm actually going to end the video if it's not too long. Because I don't want to, you know, get rejected on the video again. Not like rejected, I just don't want YouTube to reject the video for it being too long. I can't wait to use the Hypno Shroom. Because what the Hypno Shroom does... Well, you, I just read it for you, but basically, that's what it does. It hypnotizes zombies and makes them, and makes them fight other zombies for you. And I'm, I literally love the Hypno Shroom because of that. Because I can hypnotize those football player zombies into fighting for me. And football player zombies are really tough. So the, I can do that. Put get that pea shooter. That I want to try the hypno shroom, but um, didn't wait till the football players, uh, you know, or like coming. Need more sun. I need more sun than that. Come on, freaking really? I have to. Okay, so doing good so far. We just need to put some pea shooters. Because that's what's going to save us, is those pea shooters. Now would be a good time to give me more freaking sun to hypnotize this football player, zombie. Please, please, please. Give me more sun. Give me more fun. Give me more freaking sun. Come on. No, 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 no. No! No! 
soon as you eat that, you're gonna freaking fight for me. There. Oh, God. Jesus Christ. Those freaking football players are a pain in the ass. You can see that that football player almost got through my defenses. Putting that. Give me more sun. Give me, give me more sun. Give me more sun. Give me more sun. There we go. There we go. Okay, I'm gonna have plenty of time for this video. This video was only about, I mean, this level was only about like five minutes long. So put a pea shooter. I'm gonna get another 75 sun and hypnotize any football player zombie. I'm well over 75, son. Just putting a walnut. Okay. There you are. That was a terrible idea. To sacrifice the, th the thing. What is it called? It was a terrible idea to sacrifice, to sacrifice the cherry bomb. You know what? Just, just eat through it. Get run over by my lawnmower. Okay, so guys, that, okay, let's read this for Scaredy Shroom, long range shooter that hides when enemies are, get near it. Okay guys, that is the end of the video, um, that's the end of the video, and I'm gonna see you guys in the next part of Plants vs. Zombies walkthrough, bye.